Hi and welcome to this DCP web tutorial. In today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to install Atom, which is a text editor, onto Windows 10. So let's open up our web browser and we'll go to this website called atom.io. It's a text editor that you can use to write code. It's very robust, it's got a really clean style to it. I really like this uh, particular text editor. So it's available for Windows 64-bit, uh, Windows 7, 8 and 10. So let's download this. And we'll open up this folder. It's not a small file, it's around 140 meg, but I think that's quite sensible. So we'll just drag and drop this into the folder here. And close down the web browser. And we'll just double click on the file to launch the installer. So we're just waiting for the software to be installed. There's no real on-screen instructions. It will just install it and then launch it as soon as it's been fully installed. So we'll just wait for that to happen. And there you can see the browser is now up and running the text editor. So normally what I do is I just go into here and I just close down all of these tabs. Just close all this stuff down. And then we just got an empty editor here. And then we can simply open up our folder where we've got some work take this index file, just drag and drop it in, and then you've got all your code nicely laid out, easy to read, easy to understand. And I really like the way that the text editor is working, it's color coded, so it's really easy to read through your code and understand your code better and work with it. You can also create a GitHub re repository here as well. So it's quite a robust tool, you can create a repository here, and you can share your content with your other developers if you're working in a group on a particular project. If you're just working for you by yourself, then you can just you know, use this as it stands and I will be doing some more tutorials on this maybe we'll work out work on some HTML coding and some different types of tutorials but feel free to download the software and experiment with it and see what you think so that's the end of this tutorial that's how you go about installing the Atom text editor onto Windows 10 I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial